Dawn. Oh, from Pokemon? Yeah. I did have a big kitty crush on her. Oh, 100%. It was her and May. Not so much, Misty. I, I like Misty because I was really into Town Girls. Yeah. No, I, I got her vibe. Like, I thought she'd be a cool bro, but I didn't exactly want to, um... Saw logs. Those are the best girls, though, because it's like hanging out with a bro that you can just, like, sleep with. Well, yeah, but, but, but... Yeah, yeah, don't look at me like that after saying that! You can't disagree with me, it's just the truth. I just love, I just wish there was a bro I could fuck right now. I, if you had a pussy, I would date you. Well... <laughs> Thanks to Yellow Pikmin, you fucking awesome dude. What? Uh, no, that was funny. We're in space now. Gonna, y y y she, uh, Brittany stole my dream journal! <laughs> <laughs> Your skills are weak. My favorite part of this uh, game is when you're on the way back, and then it turns out um, they're all eating lunch, they're having fruit juice together, and they're like... Charlie feels not well, then a chest burster comes out, and then it's just alien. And then turns into every single alien movie where they're on a spaceship. Captain, we're so ready to see that you're okay. That well, turns into gravity with Sandra Bullock. Yeah. Bullock. Like, Bullock. I have my faithful crew to thank for that, so thank you. I actually mistook that strange creature for you. You two have very similar features. Did you know that? To be honest, while trapped in the belly of that vile beast, I thought of only one face, Brittany. My own. I'm not gonna lie, I think those two lines in conjunction together are, kind of are actually really funny. That is funny. <laughs> um, we'll never escape PNF 404 until we locate this obs treasure obsessed Olimar fuck. <laughs> He's wow. got a cosmic drive key. He's turned him into a fucking asshole. <laughs> Don't forget why we're here. Search for fruit or a planet, or else we'll fucking starve. What if Nintendo swear, am I right? What if? What's that signal coming from over there? Okay. What if Olimar say, say cunt live on air? All a cunt. Um, dude. Yes. Oh, never mind! Yes! I was wrong, by the way. This day is not the worst day in the game. This day is easy. Oh, okay. Um, well, good thing you like You're that. gonna actually like this day a lot, I think. Oh, yeah. Um, we also unlocked Bet. a dumb bonus assignment earlier. But, um... This, this day is a little uh, difficult, but in terms of like the dates, it's one of the lighter days because I know exactly what I have to do. It's just a um, it's a it's a it's a um, you'll see. So this is the <sighs> first area we started the game in. You may remember we got to this ship as Elf, and then we were like, "Fuck yeah. this place!" <laughs> and then we just like fucked off. Here. Yeah, you know this is the first place I land on this planet. Was he really here with our key this whole time? Actually, no, he wasn't because he walked through. Where Charlie was, yeah. which we established earlier in the episode of you fucking... Alright. So the whole time, I, I... Like, the numerous times I was like, oh, is Olimar in this game? And you were just like, no. What? Did you want me to spoil it? Man, I'm so... It, it's spoiled. Yeah, secret's out. Secret's out, guys. Oh my god, wait. Hold on Olimar's a second. in this game. We might have a... I have 13 Rock Pikmin. That's, like, bad. Rock Pikmin are, like, my... One of my favorite. They're Pikmin. your jam. I fucking love Rock Pikmin because they're the they're the purple Pikmin if they weren't broken and shitty. Uh, you heard more. it here first, folks. Folks. Um, but yeah, no, they're they're adorable. I think they're some of the cutest. I think they're great. They're perfect, really. Um, I could fuck them if I could. Well, I I could fuck them if I could. <laughs> yeah, I mean, th is there anything that's inherently not true about that statement? No. Okay, so oh, oh I almost fucked that up. Okay. Th th Go, go. We're just gonna chuck some cunts. Chucking cunts. There we go. Get over there, kid. I swear to God, Charlie, fucking make it with your fat. I like when people get so huffy about saying the cunt. Oh, yeah, no, that's a very it's American like, thing. Well, it's yeah, just like, like, literally every other word that Australians say is cunt. Yeah, and also, like, I, I understand, you know, I understand general, like, mean words come from bad places. Like, I don't really like, know I where it. cunt came from that g gives it that historical power as it opposed to the it other doesn't. ones. It does, yeah. like... Like, I get... You can't call someone the N-word because that... It's... That's what we called them when we sold them on Amazon Marketplace! It wasn't yeah. fucking cool! <laughs> we said we sold them on Wish. It was not... It was very uncool and, like, you know, like, make... Alright. But... I don't know. People give, like... Huffy about cunt for no reason. Yeah. Maybe it's just because like, it sounds really mean. It does have a. It has a real. It has fucking, like a sting to it. Like yeah, you call cunt. it like, 
someone's being like a bitch to you, so you call him a cunt. A cunty cunter. Like you just destroyed that person. Yeah. You're the you're the big you're the you're the big cunt. You're the big cunt. <laughs> hey yo, you a big cunt. Walk into the gym, like what's up? I got a big cunt. <laughs> Uh, Pik Pikmin 3, episode 4, Big the Cunt, Big c the, the, the episode where we say the word cunt a lot. The cunt, cuntology. Cuntology. I'm actually working on a cunt-based rock opera. Um, very cunt-inspired. Not, not, not cunt-derivative, cunt-inspired. <laughs> well, I gotta... I picked up a bomb. I just got a whiff of your, um, Glade air freshener that you have in your room. What are you talking about? You know, the Glade air freshener that you have in your room. I have no clue what you're talking about. It's got a big whiff of it. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Got a, it, it hits me in waves. Got some more insightful commentary on that one. Um, yeah. also, I feel you like- You ever go to Bath and Body Works? I like- yeah, me neither. Anyway. All right. <laughs> hey guys. Hey, yeah. For all you listening at home, <laughs> I uh, have a body too. <laughs> yeah. I think that's enough Pikmin for them to carry it. I don't care. Um. Whenever I see someone from my past, I'm ashamed because of who I was. <laughs> <laughs> see that's see now that's a winner. See now that's funny. Chicken, see what's funny about dinner. that. Is that I understand it completely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I love meeting new people because they don't realize how terrible of a person I am. You're, like, hitting some buttons. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I get to start over with you. And then, I, the existential part of it is, is that it always ends up the same way anyway, when they just realize that you are just shit. Well... <laughs> it's just like, wow, I had never changed in that entire experience where... I'm like, man, I have these new people, and they get to see that I'm a good person now, unlike the other people. What about- what? And then you just become a terrible person anyway. I mean, I'm right here. Like, I was a big fan. I was a big fan of Stevie. I started a stupid sh fucking show with you where I play Nintendo. Oh, fucking yeah. Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, just give it some time. It hasn't sat in yet. <laughs> this, the, the draining factors of the Stevie. Yeah, it's it's the Stevie fatigue. You're gonna fucking Steve fatigue. You're gonna mention Radiohead one day, and I'm just gonna be like, no. That's why we're still friends, because I haven't talked about Radiohead yet. <laughs> it hasn't begun. De oh, this. Oh, this was. Oh, oh this was. Oh, I this? was just pre-gaming. <laughs> um, for I I don't I haven't talked about it, but I am a very large fan of Radiohead. Not as much anymore as I was in high school, because it definitely got me through high school. But mm -hmm. I think I talked about Radiohead more than anything else. And when I was in high school. I feel that. Except that I was a big modest mouse kid for a while. <laughs> yeah. Of course I was. You, you just latch onto something that just it speaks to you. Yeah. The radio had spoke to me, I guess. Or you get really fucking into Weezer. At. Christian. When you just can't stop listening to the Green Album. Or, or we pick albums that are good. Um. I mean, that's just objective. Yeah, sure. Oh, um, you're very funny, haha, <laughs> but my good friend. I mean, it's, it's got hash pipe on it. Also, uh, Elf. And Island in the Sun. Yeah, which is actually gonna be the official YouTube theme song for this show. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hip, hip, because we're trying to be hip, hip. Um, so we're gonna <laughs> take the- <laughs> We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna move some bitches. Move some bitches. Um, and also what's happening right now is Alf got separated from us because we had to do a whole puzzle where we threw three people. So yeah, we got so stuck in the middle. Kinda... But I don't have enough time to like be like, Alf, come on. So we're just gonna be having him slowly slalom behind us <laughs> while we're setting up this whole thing. So like, I, I would Whoa. say right about, that was an accident. Okay, well I just wasted my cool potion. <laughs> That's good. Fuck, I hate when I waste my cool potion. Fuck, my special drink. Um, mom only gives me three liters a day because it has too much potassium. I brought my potion, you brought Oh my god. Potion, right? I found, I found, um, that must be Olimar. So. No, we're stupid. We were like, that. Is that an Olimar? It was phone. Um. I hate when that happens. Yeah, but luckily we're okay because the phone's alive. So. Because it's a Nokia. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Yeah, it is. Isn't it funny to say that Nokia's last forever? That's some Nokia right there. That's after year 200 of owning your fucking Nokia. Um, that's me when I wake up in the morning. <laughs> that's me when I know it. Um, so it's me, it, me when I have 
These physics are lovely. Um, to me, when I pair bond with a new female, <laughs> that's genetically fit to carry on my children. I. <laughs> um. So. It's literally me. This boss is literally me. Right literally now. MFW face one. I'm not. Oh my god. <laughs> um. So so this boss is. Oh my god. He's gonna fucking. This boss is a little bit luck of the draw. Um. In terms of what he does, move to move, because when he when he does, yeah. <coughs> Oh, Sorry. I thought you had a real good funny. So no. he'll either when pop out of the ground or make sinkhole, and when he make sinkhole, when he makes sinkhole, he uh, you can lit. throw bomb into mouth, which is which which work. Ew. Um, Ew. But otherwise, you can't do much, and you run out of the bombs. Are not like it's a very like oh you're definitely not gonna always have bombs. So, but actually, speaking of bombs, I hate that he's wet, but he's in sand. Well. <laughs> in the future, go ahead, defend it. In the future, sand is wet. Okay. <laughs> All right. Look, in my ideal economy, after my three-step plan, step one, Pikmin. Step two, Pikmin. Step three, profit. Yeah, well, because it's 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 a loot beneficial society only, okay. where only loot can survive. But really, is it <laughs> is it the world's fault for making a world that I couldn't survive in? So Alf is actually Maybe. just gonna go on a sideshow this episode because okay. we need him to blow up a gate with this bomb. So he's just gonna fucking peace out, <sighs> which is cool. He doesn't get to see the sand belching mirror slug as he is. Oh fuck! If that boulder landed on one of uh, the bomb Pikmin, we would be in a lot of trouble. Indeed. Because then the bombs just go Indeedy. off. Which I have had, uh, that has happened before in oh. my life. Um, but my thing, okay, see, I can tell because of the way he's going in the circle right now, he's about to do a big sinkhole. Um, just because I know, I know this shit too well. Like, when he does that, you're fucked. There we go. Okay. So, he's going to do that, and, oh. 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 Alright, sacrifice. Oh. oh, that's like a, an ant lion. <laughs> I just love the fact that the, the the sacrifice of the Pikmin's life is inherent. You can technically have them drop the bomb, but it's like more of a thing. <laughs> it's just it's like, like a kamikaze whole, into it? Yeah, it's a whole... That's hilarious. Oh, hold on. Oh shit, oh shit. Speaking of... Uh, oh god! Oh no, 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 no! Oh, I fucked this up! <laughs> Should've clicked oh, away! Fuck. Should've clicked away! Oh no, 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 no! Bri okay, well, Brittany's, oh, Brit Brittany's not gonna make it Brittany's out of this one. dead. Alright. Oh. How many Pikmin made it out of that? I have no idea with how oh, that no. cutscene played out. We have a little crew. I don't think anyone died. What he the swallowed fuck? the bomb. There's no way it's not. Is that a cat <laughs> picture? <laughs> no, that's a meerkat. Uh, no, fuck, not a meerkat. A fucking ferret. <laughs> oh, game? Game? It does this game? sometimes. Um, I left. Left. I left. Left. Yeah. Left. Left. I... Luke. There we go. Okay. Well. Um, so, yeah, we're back. Oh. Um, so this is why this day's a bitch. Kind of. So we're gonna, first off, big this, is, this is a big part. Big frothing cunt. Sorry. You got it. Um, <laughs> so what happens here is, and it's all on the technicals of this game. Uh -huh. So, cat. that's a cat. So, Give me a baby. there are a ton of pieces of watermelon here, right? And we have to, this is all one, like, fruit, sort of. Oh, okay. So, so you need to bring them all back to fulfill it? Yes! Well, not really. I mean, we have infinite time, you know? Um, but the goal is to get them all back before the end of the day, because then I don't have to go out of my way for it. But the big issue this would create if I was, like, say, doing a real bad run. All right. Um, so we're going to send Elf through here. And you're going to, so you see how they're coming this way? Mm -hmm. You're gonna start to get an idea for what the fact that there are two loading screens between these, what it kind of begins to make sort of uh, transpire, if you will. Hi, Lily. I know you're a very sweet girl. You cross on the bridge. Um, so they essentially just all start to get constipated. Um. Oh, I feel that. <laughs> if you're lactose intolerant, you know. We're receiving a transmission from. Drake. I ate a fucking quesadilla before this recording. I'm gonna... Poop? Really Hopefully. bad? All over my cat? Yeah, all over your room. Also, this is a folded data glutton, which is cute. Oh. It's low on battery. Used on this planet. Its signal, its signal strength is very powerful. So, by using this, we're gonna unlock the next area, which is where the two bitch days, which are gonna be, uh... 
Oh, also like an all-nighter, because he's so excited to dig into the phone. But, mm. um, oh, it canceled my go here. Great. I like how the cat just comes in for like three seconds and just fucks off. Oh, yeah, no, like, she, immediately. she literally does it just to flex <laughs> that it's her territory, not mine. But yeah, if you notice, we didn't walk by all the Pikmin there, because some of them were stuck. They were here. Oh. They were in no man's land of loading. So, what I actually did differently this time on accident is I kind of divvied up when they started carrying it more, which seemed to work a bit better, because they get they normally just get a bit congested. And more more than that, if you take too long, like, it, it takes longer to get this shit back there, or at least it did on the Wii U because of these loading sections, because it's not, like, that for them, you know? Right. It's like... It, it yeah. has to actually, like, render them. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what it does to track it, because they go beyond, like, see, that fucking eight, like... It's going. Yeah, it's going. And for and me, the gone. door ends there. So huh. I think it's supposed to be more physically like, oh, they're oh, yeah, here they're, now. Yeah, they're coming. But... It's weird. And so, like, you fast travel, but they just actually go through it. Yeah, that's just one of the weirder things about this game. Um, speaking of, we're actually going to get a slight head start on some shit while we've got extra time. We've got extra time, um, baby. So, one, our Pikmin numbers are dwindling one. hard. One! Um, that's probably one. how many rock pick when we have left. That was one. One. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, what actually is over here? You know what? Uh. Go here. Here. Fuck it. Um. Sure. Brittany, you know what? Have fun. We might actually get that item that I was like, oh, we're not gonna get that. We're gonna get it. Whoa. I did it. A little suit. Can't, yeah, it's it's kind of cute. Like, <laughs> I I think it. I'm guessing it increases your armor or whatever, and just the fact that it's like shitty like warriors outfit for spacesuit is kind of adorable. Mm -hmm. But um, what we're gonna do is we don't get to touch this area for a long time because you kind of need mm -hmm. winged and water Pikmin to like really get into the meat of it. Yeah. But what I forgot about in the past is one haha big ass. Um, big fucking ass. That's what that is. That's a big. That's my girl's fucking sweet, big, smelly stinky, ass. Tasty ass. Um, <laughs> I think we both immediately went for something that smells bad. Yeah, we feel it. Yeah, you. Feel it's a vibe. It, it do you be get like us. that you get when it. you have a big stinky ass. But um, I love big stinky ass. <laughs> Smelling it. Yeah. Do you think this is the best <laughs> thing we've ever recorded ever? And how do we get it into the hands of Butch Vig, Nirvana producer? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. Um. Ew. Yeah, I'll just let them be. <clears throat> Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Fuck you. I wasn't even trying to kill them. I was just more trying to kill the other shit. I forgot them. I could come out here is what I'm trying to say. My practice playthrough and getting this might even help me get in the... What do you got for me, Drake? Very okay, seeming. I just skipped it that time. And look, look <laughs> at this. They have a little art on here, and I don't know if you can tell... But it kind of oh, looks like, movie. kind of looks like one of the captains. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna choose to elect that I think it's resembling Olimar and not Louie. Well, I think that you're wrong and stupid, so, and gay, probably. Well, I was gonna say more so because <laughs> Louie is hinted at in the lore to be a murderous mastermind. That's <laughs> not a bit. Um, That'd be funny. Oh no, it's not, I'm not fucking, like, uh, this isn't like a joke. I mean, I think it was just funny in general. And he's just like... Oh. <laughs> this insane overlord. Yeah, no, like there's heavy handing iron fist. There's there's just a big like the implication seems to be he can communicate with bugs and he may or may not be the final boss of Pikmin 2 indirectly like the final boss is like, you know, a monster or whatever. Mm -hmm. But it seems that Louis may or may not be controlling <coughs> it with his mind, which is really fun. Um so is Louis a here. secret bad guy? That seems to be the kind of well Incidental bad guy in some cases, other cases he seems to be a, just a bad guy. Hmm. Like, he's a very, like, he is, like, the big, vague question mark of the series, where, like, some people think he's... So it's actually never been answered. Yeah, some people think he's an actual villain, some people think he was just pissed during this one situation, and other people just think he's an absolute weirdo. Because there's another twist in Pikmin 2 regarding him that doesn't actually come on the main story of the game, but I'll probably save it for them just so you don't get, like, uh... But, um, he actually, like, inadvertently may or may not cause most of Pikmin 2's plot. Wow. Yeah, um, it's pretty funny. But, um... Louis. 
that one had to be the smoothest day yet because um I did did oh oh, okay. <laughs> oh shit where did you guys go what did you what? we were all there we were all there at the end of the day you know I think it's their fault you know these <laughs> fucking idiots like the best part is that this game added a feature and I don't know how it even works where I can talk to the Drake and call all the Pikmin just back. I don't know if they, like, walk over or whatever. <laughs> but theoretically, there's a system I can mess with. But I'm uh -huh. like, I refuse, you know? That's not how I play pick. You gotta you gotta pick up your toys after. This is a pocked or a poked or a something airhead. Which is pocked cute. Airhead. Um, but yeah, as you can see, we have Pocket big, airhead. big pieces of watermelon. They're all... Um, big pieces of watermelon. They actually look really fucking... You know, I've got the biggest pieces of watermelon. The <laughs> China. There we go, I did it. I did funny You did the boys. funny. You've achieved comedy. The China, right? Dapper Blob, of course, which we've picked up before. Welcome to The Tonight Show, starring... Uh, Keith Richards. Alright, uh, dude, are we gonna fucking forget Ben Affleck's name for 30 minutes again? Ben Affleck. Because I was thinking of uh, the, the Ben Affleck Trump when you said live. I was like, live from New York. Saturday night. What? We explain. Okay, so I said, haha, China, right? Yeah. Like the orange guy. Uh huh. Um, orange man bad. And then you said the whole, like, oh, live. And for some reason, my brain thought, SNL. Yeah, SNL. I, and I thought about the funny, not Ben Affleck, Alec Baldwin. I did forget his name. <laughs> Fuck! 